Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie and this is episode 132 of my Dire Wolf 20 1.18 Let's Play. And we are back here again today to do some more stuff and things, man. There's so much to blood magic. <laughs> um, I've been over here just uh, building up, building up my uh, blood trying to get all the demonic slates all caught up and get some more uh, blood in my network. Uh, but I haven't gotten mm -hmm. all of the stuff and things. Why did everything get moved? Um, yeah, I've been making some ritual stones, so I used up some of the... Uh, some of the slates there uh, so it's building up some more because uh, i just made 32 ritual stones that took all the slate that i had uh, because the ritual stone takes reinforce the slate uh, so you pretty much get for each reinforced slate you get a ritual stone since it takes four and you get four uh, so I had 32 slate, so I might want to maybe bump up my reinforced slate number so that I keep a base of 64 instead of 32. That way, if I need a large number of ritual stones for a ritual, I can come in and make them all at once instead of having to wait for it to build back up. So that would be kind of cool. Uh, another thing is now that it has to be pretty much full to get those done, um, I have to like waste a lot of the, uh, the poking, the bonus that I get from this because it's mostly full when I have to, uh, you know, use my knife to get some blood. Uh oh, um, Seriously, what happened to my... Oh, it's building up the blank slates now. But I thought I had some. Look at that. It's like, it's not putting it in there. Better... <clears throat> I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I did, it wasn't seeing it uh, in the network again when I did at Blood. Uh, so there was something wrong with it, and I broke, I broke this little guy down here, and then reconnected, and it still didn't seem to work. Uh, so I just broke this block and replaced the storage bus, and then put everything back in. But while it was uh, just the plain storage bus, I guess it somehow moved stuff out of here. Uh, how about that happened? But it did, so I uh, had to spend a little bit of time today instead of, like, getting ready for the episode. I had to stop and make, <laughs> make a lot of food because I've been going through the food left and right. Oh, uh. The, the blood magic, I mean, even though I have the regen and the heal spell, it still makes me eat. <laughs> it still makes me eat. Uh, so, yeah, I had to go and get some more, uh, get some more food going. Man, I've just been running through so much food. So I had made a whole bunch of shepherd's pie and I went through them. So I went through and made some more so that is good excellent uh, i've been trying to get uh things together to go to the second demon realm um it is called the endless realm it it it's a much bigger ritual it takes uh, 69 runes, um, 150 life points, or, uh, is 
the cost for the activation. So I definitely will have to get more life points in my system before I can do that. Because I think I only have like 120,000. It may be less now since I've been using this ritual to regen. Um, so let's see, where are you at? Yeah, I had 120,000 in it when I started. So yeah, it's been draining about 15,000 life points from my system. So I definitely need to get that, need to get that going. Mm -hmm. But I have to make these um, slates so that I can, uh, you know, get this ritual and go deeper into the demon realm. Which will be um, pretty cool, I think. Um, yeah, and I kind of picked out another spot over here. I'm hoping this will be a big enough area for it. Right over here. Maybe to get some little pathways going up or something. But yeah, that's the plan. It's just, oh man, uh, having to stop and, and make a bunch of food, that kind of threw things off. Um, but I did, I did get, I took my test kitchen out of the cozy cottage. Like, I just feel really cramped in there. I have no room. Uh, <laughs> so I, I gutted it, the basement, and put... The test kitchen in the super secret underground base um so yeah i haven't really got it a hundred percent set up but it is um a little bit set up <laughs> i have uh, all these things set down i have some of it getting stocked i'm gonna use interfaces and the uh, laser nodes to keep certain things in here uh, so I can just come over and go pick out what I want and make it up real quick so yeah that uh, <laughs> I have dreams of automating this because like who wants to spend all their time in the kitchen uh, <laughs> cooking up the food when there's you know adventure to be had uh, so, yeah, there's a cool way uh, with uh, the cooking mod. I think it's Farmer's Delight, uh, where you can basically double your meat and uh, you use a knife and you slice the meat up and you get twice as much meat. It's, it's magical. Um, but I would like to be able to, since I don't have any real automation for the meat going on right now, I need to set up, reset up all the infrastructure that I had getting these items coming in and, so that I can have them coming in. But till then, I need to really be a little bit efficient <laughs> with the resources that I do have because they are limited. My animal resources are are very, very limited. Uh, let's see, can I, uh, let's just look at stored items. Uh, it would probably be easier to look at the, uh, the storage facility and stuff guys these are more items that i need to get over there yes it would definitely be cool to have an automated well-stocked kitchen <laughs> to just uh you know auto automatically have all the stuff and things um yeah that would be cool
All right, how's this thing doing? Not doing anything. I'm up to, I think, 200%. I think it's capped at 200% right now. Because it was at like 190 when I put this uh, last row in. Uh, and I'm pretty sure this last row gave me way more than that. But I think it's just capped at 200%. So I'm, I'm going to like upgrade these paths with the worn stone paths. Um, just haven't gotten around to it yet. So mm -hmm. oh, there's my reinforced slate. Man, yeah, I definitely need to, uh, I definitely need to keep that, that thing uh, stocked a little bit better. Uh, so me sleep and I'm gonna set this up to allow for like uh, 64 64 uh, see up yeah let's up this to do do 63 there. think uh no not you it's you yeah gotta upgrade this one too there we go uh, now it should be a little bit better <laughs> so that next time i come in and i need a ritual done i'll be able to get 64 ritual stones which <laughs> still might not be enough because this one's going to take 69 plus the master ritual stone. So it's going to take 73. Um, it's just no good. <laughs> um, so well, this guy is making stuff. Let me go run back over to the kitchen and drop this stuff off. Uh, I just kind of been throwing it. There we go. Just want to get all the food stuff over there and then I'll go through these and, and get it to stock things for me. Uh -oh. Because right now all I have is this being stocked, wheat, potato, carrot, and onion, and <laughs> bottles and bowls. Uh, so I'm always going to have bottles and bowls, unless there's a kind of bowls. Um, that would be sad. I need to get it, I guess, a way to make the bowls. I put a crafting card in there and I have the recipe for a bowl in the system it should automatically I'm not worried about the bottles because I have tons of bottles but I just made up all the shepherd's pies so I'm kind of low on bowls um, <laughs> but as I eat the shepherd's pies uh, and throw them in the system it's gonna it's gonna restock it uh, sort of um so yeah let's see if, let's put a crafting card oh i need to craftables there we go crafting card there we go um Uh, now I guess I need to make a recipe for the bowl. Let's go do that real quick and see if this works. Okay. Oh, wrong one. It's been so long since I've been over here. Bowl. Yep, that will work. Let's put that right there. Uh. Now, it should just automatically 
wrapped up the bowls and keep them stocked. Look at it. It's going. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's great. I love, I love automation. Uh, I'll just go over there. Continue to get our slates up, uh, made up. I, I really hate it that um, it's looking for so much blood, even for the little ones. I mean, I wish there was a way to separate that out uh, where when it was down, when it needed the little ones, it would just go, oh, I need a thousand for this so I can start it. Um, yeah. Imbued slate. Oh man, we got a long way to go. I might not have enough time to get this done today. It is a lot of slates. Uh, a lot. There we go. Oh boy. Okay. Um, man, oh man, I thought I was going to be able to get this done today. Um, it's just all the distractions, all the food I had to make, <laughs> all the adjustments. Uh, I spent a lot of time get, just getting filling buckets with blood, <laughs> filling this up. Uh, I don't know. I think this looks really cool. I like the the deep red of the blood from Blood Magic. It just, I don't know. It's a very, very pleasing color of red to look at. <laughs> a lot of the red is bright, and this is just a very deep red. Uh, deep, deep red. I like it. Oh, man, I had my heart set on going to the demon realm today. Mm. Mm. Oh, boy, I didn't, uh, didn't think that it was going to, uh, you know, take that long to, it seems like it's taken a lot longer because this thing keeps stopping because it's looking for 23,000 <laughs> to start the demonic slate. See, look at that. I am eating just so much. I'm eating so much. Um... I was thinking, I got this supply camp <laughs> out of, I don't even remember where I got it from. Uh, oh, it was in one of the chests in the demon realm. That's right. I could go set this up, I guess. I don't know. I kind of want, I want to do this, but I know, uh, I have 10 minutes for this video uh, <laughs> left on it. It's not going to be enough time to get, get all the slate, um, unfortunately. I guess I'm only at 19 and I need, I need at least another 32 slate just to get to 64 and I need 73 <laughs> so it's uh it's gonna take a good amount of time still um there is another ritual that i am interested in uh which is the um Where did it go? It's the one I already looked at, so pretty sure. 
Oh, no, I didn't look at it. It's the Ritual of the Feathered Knight. This is the one that, um, it basically pricks yourself for you. <laughs> uh, if you're there in range, it will, uh, it will prick you. It will do some damage and add blood to your blood altar. Uh, gains are affected by runes of self-sacrifice, which we have, and tough palms. What is tough palms? Tough palms. It doesn't do anything. If I click on it. Oops. I have no idea what tough palms is. Uh... It sounds pretty cool, though. It sounds like something that I would, I would get <laughs> after repeatedly cutting my palm open to get the blood. Um, this is something that I would be interested in doing. And if you look at this, it sort of matches, um, fits on top of the. Uh, Ritual of Regeneration. See, uh, we've got a lot of area in the middle that it's open, and the corners um, have this area over here open up, uh, so it would fit like right, <laughs> right in there somehow. Yeah, so it would it would pretty much go like right here in the corner, and this is where the corner section would be taken out. So there's plenty of room here at the corners for this section to fit in. And there's plenty of room in the middle for that one to fit in. The only problem is um, if it needs to be butted up right up against that or uh, go one down. I forget. Um, so that that would be something pretty cool to look into as well. Um, I would still like to be able to uh, start accruing will. That would be nice to not have to go and spend hours um, killing mobs <laughs> over and over again. Oh, the Well of Suffering uh, is the one you would use at your not this type of altar, but one you would put uh, with the other type of altar where you kill the mobs, uh, and then this will attack the mobs and put blood in your altar. So that is really nice. I like uh, I like both types of setups. I'm I'm equally okay doing either one. Um. I like the self-sacrifice one. It has each one has its own advantages and stuff. Uh, like it, it does get frustrating to have to run all the way over there and run all the way back. Uh, <laughs> uh, it, so it's, I mean, yeah, it's personal preference, I guess. Whether you prefer to run over there or you prefer to have the mobs uh, raining down on you and stuff. Uh, so yeah, Pathway to the Endless Realms is what I'm shooting for. Um, <laughs> it's, it's just going to take longer than I have to look at that. We got 15 of the 16 Demonic Slates. Um, I might want to bump up the Imbued Slate to 32 as well. So.
there. This might I might need to to have more of the stuff. That would be swell. Um, so, yeah, I was thinking I could put a little pathway over here, maybe decorate this up a little bit instead of it just being plain stone and then run like a little... Uh, Pathway down to here to have the other uh, demon realm thingamajobber. Um, I guess I could put the the wall back over here. I wasn't sure how far back I needed to cut it, uh, so I just I just chopped it off. <laughs> Let's get this going. Boop. There we go. Yeah, it would definitely be cool to have it look for each specific thing, but I just don't think I have enough room um, to, to separate them out into their own individual systems. What do we got? Reinforced slate. We almost have enough to get the other 32 ritual stones. Oh boy. Okay. Um <laughs> let's uh let's go go over here because I have been meaning to start um mine colonies uh just to play around with it uh i really like mine colonies it's a good mod i i i like it it's a way to be to get your automations and and be like a lot more interactive with it and stuff i think i think this would be a good place yeah and i can just go boop Oh, I forgot I have uh, the silk touch thing on. I love this thing. Oh, man. You get all the stuff. I'm going to have all the leaves. Oh, that. Now, I don't know if I need to uh, have it or if it will kill the grass. Yeah. See, this is like um, a full chunk. But what I want is like, uh, I think you can select a tower yeah like this one so you can go boop and then boop that one is over see it fits perfectly inside the chunk uh that's cool and look this hilltop is like four chunks i think that would be perfect uh would be a great little uh, fortress place up here and you could have the city sprawling all around as far as the eye can see uh, i think that would be super cool <laughs> okay Let's um, do this. Boink. Not all blocks in the area meet the requirements. Uh, 
Recheck the highlighted blocks. Here we go. Okay, so these have to be solid blocks, right? That's easy enough to, to figure out. Let me get rid of that too. Um, so let's get rid of some of these. Get some, I guess, dirt. Dirt. Aha, you can see not a solid. Yes. Oh, dude, I forgot. That's what I need. Uh, now this thing could be pretty cool. Uh, like I could use this little um, fortress as uh, and hook up one of my uh, my little. Uh, oops. <laughs> my quantum singularities over here and get uh you know everything just like put up oops all right that should do it now dang it i, have, I hate it that i have to replace it uh yeah go back and over go and I gotta select the same thing there we go now is it still lined up yeah it looks like it okay uh check whoa there we go now we can turn this off I got a slime oh there's a slime a slime island up there Whack. Okay, they're not going to hurt me. So there we go. We got a little uh, supply camp over here. It's pretty cool. Uh, it's got a power. Uh, I don't like it that it's just grass in here, whatever floor it was. Uh, And it's got upstairs and here's the build tool and the town hall that you need to get started with this oh there's also a bamboo here an acacia a cactus um <laughs> they got all sorts of stuff uh it's a big campfire with a uh, wheat block underneath it to uh the smoke as far up in the air as possible. There's also like a sapling of each kind. Here's another bamboo. Or what's that? Sugar cane up there. It's a sugar cane. There are also stuff in these um, to help get you going. And there are hidden blocks um, around. I think they're like under here. No, maybe it's this one. No. Oh, I bet it's um up here. Ah, there's a chest. I didn't know this was here. Look at that. You get cocoa, bamboo, cactus, sugar cane. What? Oh, that's the wrong block. Is there another one over here? No, but that's a gold block up here uh, and a block of coal. Oh, but you can see that one. So, yeah. Um, I'll probably play around with that if I ever have time. 
Let's see. Let's sleep. Um, I'm not going to be able to get this ritual done today. I'm, I'm very sad. <laughs> I wanted to go to the demon realm again. Um, so sad face. Um, hello. He's dying. Any anybody else? Any creepers? I hate the creepers. They sneak up on you and stuff. Okay, so get rid of those. All right, so I feel really unproductive <laughs> for the day. We we almost got enough to almost get enough for the ritual. Uh, but I will definitely work on this uh, more off camera uh, to, to get all the slates that are needed for this ritual. And then, and then we can make some more keys. I'll probably try to get a couple of keys made up ahead of time maybe uh so that you know we can just go in and, and then and then fun stuff so anyway i'm gonna go ahead and call the episode here and i will see you next time thank you for watching and bye bye